While we agree for the need for an early vertical forearm, it is hard to ignore the need for the most basic fundamentals, like maintaining high hips on all strokes. One of our favorite drills to create high hips is what we call a 360 T press. We make sure our kids understand that their lungs are like balloons that make their top end more buoyant. And their hips are like rocks making their back end sink. So instead of constantly telling them to get their hips up, we only tell them to press their teeth, which means pressing down on their chest and torso to get the hips up. But this means they can spend a lot of time learning to T-press in one position such as face down or face up. But this doesn't teach them the instinct that we need them to have for all strokes. For the 360 T-press, we have them kick for a rhythm such as 9 kicks in each position. We have them start face down for 9 kicks, focusing on their T-press to keep their hips up. Then rotate to their left side and drop their top hand and kick for nine kicks. Then rotate to their back with both arms in a forward streamline again for another nine kicks. Then to their right side for nine kicks, again with their top arm on their side. It's a good drill in the endless pool as well as when circle swimming in groups. In the endless pool, they are really focused on their hips the entire time and helps them quickly understand which positions they are struggling with the most. This helps to give them some reminders on what T-Press problems they have, so they can focus on fixing their problems throughout the week.